gone, cyberspace. Hello, and welcome back to Pikmin. Today we're playing the first game in the series, Pikmin, released for the Nintendo GameCube, Nintendo Wii, and Nintendo Switch in the year 2001, uh, 2009 question mark, and 2023 respectively. You know, you know, um, I forgot what I wanted to say. Maybe someday I'll remember. Goodbye. Alright, what parts was I planning on getting today? Alright, I was planning to get Luon Drive, whatever that thing was. Uh, I'm gonna try to maybe get that one. And that leaves the number two Ionium Jet. So, uh, if we're lucky, we'll be able to get all of that done in one day. But let's be realistic here. That's not gonna happen. Alright, I think that's a lot of flowers. Alright, now we should have no problem dealing with this yellow Wally Hawk. Alright, and now we have to deal with Shearwigs. Thankfully, uh, they're not too difficult to deal with, they're more just annoying. The Pikmin that are carrying our spoils seem to be milling about in one place with their loads. It appears that their path back to the Onion is blocked, and faced with what seems to be an insurmountable obstacle, they have lost their focus. This is unacceptable! I will have to determine what is blocking their way, and do what I can to resolve the problem. They're being blocked by nothing. The, the closest thing to an obstacle here is water. And, uh, blue Pikmin can survive in water. So, really, they don't have an excuse. Oh shit. Don't let that happen. That's bad. And you don't like bad things, because bad things are bad. What the fuck was that voice I just did? I found the gluon drive using the quark. <laughs> quark. Using the quark binding metaphysical properties of gluons, this device. Well, it's, uh, very scientific, and I don't fully understand it myself. But it was very expensive. Okay, so I'm pretty sure he's the one who built the SS Dolphin, right? So why did he put a bunch of junk in it that he didn't even know what it did into his uh, spacecraft? Like, huh? Why? Why would he do that? What's wrong with this man? Oh yeah, he's full of radiation. Forgot about that. Now we can carry back the, uh, gluon drive. And by the way, it looks like a hamburger. <laughs> and now we can get the rest of our little- Okay, we can't. There's a yellow wally hop in the way. Which is bad news for me and for you. But thankfully, we can put away- <laughs> Thankfully, we can put away some of our blues and get some uh, bomb rocks. Yippee! Gluon drive. I have no idea how this works, but it means the dolphin will again lift off with its characteristic roar. Oh my, you goofball! <laughs> Well, we gotta go grab more bombs from the the bomb shelter, uh, which, uh, against what you probably expect, isn't actually a shelter to protect you from bombs. It's actually the shelter where they keep the bombs, which is a little confusing and could probably be labeled a bit better, but, uh, it's what we have. 
do not walk into the... What the hell did he just do? Look, look at Jesus over here, walking over water like it's goddamn nothing. Alright, and now we have a Wally Hop to take care of. Attack me! Kill me! Kill me! Kill me! Oh, I lost so many. No, 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 Die, 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 die. No! No! Die! What the hell is bro doing? So Pikmin are capable of teleportation. Does anyone else think that's a little weird? Because you should. Bitch! It's my zirconium rotor. This is made from rust-proof zirconium, which is particularly suited to making spaceship parts. I had to pay a lot extra to have this installed, and I suspect the mechanic overcharged me. <laughs> Welcome to another episode of Olimar Gets Scammed. It's more likely than you think. Ah, shit, are they stuck? Eh, it's bullshit. Oh, wait, no, they're not stuck. They were just being dramatic. Zirconium rotor. Made of rust-proof zirconium. It is as shiny as new, despite being left out in this planet's harsh elements. So I think that's about all the parts we can get for today. Um, let's see, who are we missing? I mean, I should probably put them back into their onions so that they don't die. There we go. Yep, there it is. Oh, and it's a flower, too. Oh, nice. Thirteen days since impact. Hope has begun to well up within me for the dolphin's repair, and my own chances for a reunion with my dear family. Tomorrow, I shall go forth with a new attitude and continue my exploration in a different region. I hope that fortune will smile upon me. Damn. That yellow Wally Hop did a huge number on the blue Pikmin population. At last! My pilot seat! Once I get this installed, my cockpit will finally be back in order. Soon, my ship will be starting to look more and more like the dolphin of old. Ah, oh, the memories. Alright, let's hope uh, they'll be safe. Uh, no, 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 no. I found my number two Ionium jet. It's easy on the eyes, and its fuel efficiency is easy on the budget. Yeah, fight me instead, bitches! My life is less important! <laughs> Alright, good, good, good. Everything went according to plan, and we should be able to get these last two parts in no time. Oh, speaking of one of those two parts, here comes one right now. God damn! did it really put 32 on it? Pilot seat. Picturing this in the cockpit, images of me lifting off into space begin to fill my tax brain. It fills me with inspiration once again. I have now recovered 28 out of 30 parts. If I can find just one more, I should be able to increase my ship's capabilities. <laughs> well, Olimar, you're in luck. Uh, seeing as how short today is, I'm probably going to put day 15 at the end of this, since it's also going to be pretty short as well. So, that should fill up a whole video. Number 2 Ionium Jet. The ads for these jets boast that, <clears throat> With excellent mileage that's easy on the family budget, this jet will keep your wife smiling and propel you to a happy home life. I have recovered 29 out of 30 parts, increasing the dolphin's capabilities. My search can now cover a wider area.
the ship is basically fully repaired, because the last uh, ship part isn't really a part of the ship. So we'll just put the Pikmin back into the Onion and go to the next day. Fourteen days since impact. At last, but a single part remains. Since I've recovered 29 of the missing parts, the dolphin's power is near capacity. In the forest depths below, I see a region where the final part must lie. Clearly, this is my final trial. My life support fails in 16 days. Courage! Alright, so we're going to grab out all of our blues and immediately get them to work on unrolling the bridge. And then we're going to get out three yellow Pikmin. These are going to grab bomb rocks. Then we're going to gently throw them down. Do not throw them over here like an idiot, because I've done that before and it's never ended well. Maybe if you're a professional and you know what you're doing, you can try it, but I still don't advise it. From experience. Alright, now we'll use the Bomb Rock Squad to take down this wall. Then, we'll put them all onto this uh, bridge, and they'll be unrolling that. Then we'll get our ten red Pikmin, and they're going to go through the fire and the flames. Oh, what the hell? Oh, and okay, we lost a couple. We gotta get some more. God damn it. All right. They're going to push that box, and then I'm going to get in position. That's a strange plant. I wonder what it could be. And that's both walls taken care of. That leaves the rest of the time in the day to convert our blue Pikmin into red Pikmin for the boss battle tomorrow. Uh, here's a neat little trick if you put the... Uh, crosshair right where you want it to be, and then you just start, uh, well, and then you cover up the Wii Remote's infrared sensor, you can, um, uh, you can cheat. Now let's start plucking. Oh, this is so fun. And that's all of it. That's all we needed to do today. Well. Fifteen days since impact. It is very strange. The scenery of this planet which I once found hostile, now sometimes strikes me as surprisingly serene. Perhaps the Pikmin have opened my heart to the beauty of this world. I even started thinking there were some parts I do not need. A daydream. You have one part left, dumbass. <laughs> well, anyway, that's about all that. Well, anyway, that's about all the time we got for today. Hopefully you liked it. Bye.